Fisher. Please tell me this Come on, is you're not what you all advertise. You're getting all misty-eyed here. I'm getting misty-eyed. Why does it feel like this is something you listen to on a Friday night? You're getting all emotional. I gotta get it to your handkerchief. Oh. Your glasses are fogging here, up. Here, I got your ear crying tell hey. as we welcome a great job in her outing as a referee. Congratulations, Kaylin Diamond. Welcome back to the booth. Thank you, thank you. I missed you guys. Not really, but I'm I here. Know. You know, I was just gonna say that was an outstanding job of refereeing, but I know. I mean, I'm a little rusty, you know? Bah. I should I should be more humble. I'm a little rusty. Hey, you remind me of Aubrey Edwards, seriously. Thank you. No crap taken from anyone. I don't know if that's a compliment or not. I'm not but, sure it yeah. is, but. <laughs> I'll take it. Thank God that music stopped. <laughs> yeah, well, I hope the insurance policy is covered. This one is going to be nonstop, I guarantee you. Definitely. Always a barn burner when Royal Flavor's in the ring. Royal Flavor just getting over, regaining the Ironheart Pro Wrestling Tag Team titles over the notorious 2 3. Yeah, they're double champs right now. They are on fire in the pro wrestling world. This is their first defense of the MAW tag titles, though. What a tremendous, enthusiastic crowd, wall to wall. Seriously, yeah. It's hot in that ring. Sit down, Andrew. Sit down, you're going to throw out a hip. Sorry about that. What was he saying? We go to Travis Sharp for the official in-ring introductions. Ladies and gentlemen, the following contest, scheduled for one fall, is for the Midwest All-Star Wrestling Tag Team Championship. And it is brought to you by the Bully Brand Clothing Company and Lake Harriet Law Offices. Introducing first, in the corner to my right are the challengers. At a total combined weight of 421 pounds, Eric Esnight and Malik Champion, they are God's chosen champions, the Prodigal Sons. <laughs> Introducing their opponents. In the corner to my left, at a total combined weight of 399 pounds, the current and defending Midwest All-Star Wrestling Tag Team Champions, the seasoning Alex Finlay, the Prince of the Southside Demo Knight, they are Royal Flava! Tremendous response, very, very popular tag team All day, Defending champions here in MAW. Yeah, they're going up against a couple first-timers. The Prodigal Sons. A big, big way to make your debut, for challenging for the Tag Team Championships right Absolutely. off the hop. RJ Wilkins drawing the assignment. Roger you know, Hart I can't the help, I, I, I can't help, sorry, Andrew, I, I can't help but make the comparison as I look at Royal Flavin to the Take team of top flight. Oh, I mean that. Yeah, to you're not to me, that it's just a. Uh, it's like, oh, what a shot! Distraction technique, and here we go. Prodigal Sons taking over on the Prince. Here comes the seasoning. The seasoning not going to take that lightly. Yeah. No, and if there's one thing about the seasoning, he's got that hot temper about him. And look at that, Ez Knight. Toss him, toss him in. Yeah. <laughs> Yep. One over the that top worked. and one caught a boot to the mouth. That worked about two seconds. People better watch out. Oh. Trip up. Punt. A senton. Look at this teamwork. Oh my gosh. That's what it's all about. That's how you become tag team champions. 
Devo Nye, that was amazing agility for that young man. Yeah, he, he literally did it off of one step. Oh. Hit the helo, took one step and dove through the ropes, man. Awesome stuff. Oh, no. Oh, if there's one thing, watch Alex fly! Oh, hit the middle. Oh! Smart move. He repositioned himself. Asai Moonsault. Classic Ultimo Dragon. The Asai's off the second, Andrew. That was off the apron. But it was a moonsault all, all the same, I suppose. How many times did Dragon do it off, off what, the apron? What, once again, once again, I'm, I'm situated between the two of you. <laughs> You're getting Don't paid. beat him up. You're getting paid extra, Mick. I should be getting paid extra. <laughs> you got your referee's bonus for doing a great job. You certainly yeah. did, and a great job it was. Definitely. We're proud of you. Nice, nice goal. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, oh, man. No. Good grief. Face first into that lower buckle. Okay, now that we have somebody that knows the inside of a ring, Kaylin Diamond, what, what is behind that corner, that border, corner buckle path? No. Steel. <laughs> yeah. There's not much cushioning in, at all. No, not at all. It's simply to... Mm to conceal the steel that's underneath, so. You know, it's not a lot different than a wrestling mat. You got boards under there, and that's about it. A little bit of padding. Yep. It's, it's not much. It's not as much as you might think. Here we go. Crowd picking up the chain of Devo. Oh! Big knee drop there by his knight. Prodigal sons are doing an awful lot of complaining. <laughs> To the senior official here. 25 minutes remaining yeah. in this contest. 25 minutes. Wait a minute. Come on now. But also manipulating. Turn around. He ain't, doing a, he ain't giving a prayer, that's for sure. Oh, come on. Oh, oh. Okay, now that's why as I didn't. Now him and Malik can just go to town. Hey, you know what? Smart tag team wrestling, I guess. You know, if you can make a pawn out of the referee, you might as well do it. I, yeah. I'm surprised somebody with the, the uh, experience of RJ fell for that. But hey, we all make mistakes. Chin lock here applied by Is Knight. Again, ladies and gentlemen, if you're just joining us, this is a, a swan song, kind of a bittersweet evening for Steel Domain Wrestling working in conjunction with MAW, SDW, after 26 years, closing the doors. Devo trying to close the door between him and his partner. Look at this, oh, so close. Oh, oh. God, almost Jake Robert-esque on that short arm clothesline. Put his head into orbit, count of two and a half, wow. Mick, you and I go back to Grand Slam and how Royal Flavor won that in that ladder match. Oh, the violent gentleman. Spectacular. Yeah, they, they earned their stripes, no doubt about it. Mm. Oh. Devo just taking a beating here, man. Finley is itching to get in the ring. Prodigal Sons are pretty damn impressive here early on. Absolutely. I know for a fact both of those men train out of Seth Rollins Academy. So. Oh, come on. Well-trained individuals out in Iowa. Sucker punch there by Eric Esnight. I got to give okay. these two credit. They are absolutely cutting off the ring. They've got the referee befuddled. They're doing a lot of double teaming and getting away with it. They, oh, oh, no. no. Oh, gosh. Good God. Well, oh. that'll put an end to your night. Sling blade to the heart attack. That's got to do. No, no way. Oh, 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 wow. It takes a lot more to put down the Prince. You know, I look at a team like the Prodigal Sons and for how much they're dominating, it reminds me of the tag team three under par. Absolutely. Great comparison there. <laughs> That's a no nonsense tag team we're looking at right now. Line up a shot. Big shoulder into the gut. Catches it. Oh, and a chop right across the sternum. 
follows up with that running lariat. Oh, I tell, I tell you just what. About to say. Oh. Trying to fight back. Does he have enough in the tank? Oh, he got yeah, his own there partner. You go. He got both of them. He got both days at least. Good oh, that Geary. Not right much to the, the ear. Not much left in the tank, but he's he's oh, trying. He's crawling to make that tag. Yeah, Malik is way too powerful at this point. Oh, oh Spanish good fly. Lord. Beautiful job by the Spanish fly. I think. Can Alex, he get over there? Can he make the tag? Is Alex Finley ready to burn up out of the pantry? Yeah, well, here, here we go. Somebody call the fire department. This place is Series on fire. of three rights. Oh, the <laughs> chop. Timber. Put a little seasoning on it. Yeah. <laughs> Got those elbows in the corner. Oh. Malik tried to kill him for that charge. Elbow to Eric. You want some action and a tag team match, ladies and gentlemen? Look no further than the ring right now. Look at him pounding, wailing away. Go to town, Alex. And I'll say that gets rather exhausting the longer you're oh. in a match. You, you wouldn't know it. Yeah, but if, one, if we know one thing about Alex Finley, he has been working so many. Oh, beautiful. Blue, Blue Thunder Bomb. bomb. That's it. No. Oh, that's and again. No, no, no. no I don't no, know why the buzzer. Wait a minute. Referee Roger Buck. Or uh, timekeeper Roger Buck, a little quick on the draw that time. Yeah. Rang the bell. He got spooked. Getting admonished <laughs> by uh, not only the referee, but also by longtime oh, fan Bruce Anderson. Yeah, oh, here comes Ed. Well, Roger looks like you're going to dock and pay, buddy. Sorry. <laughs> if only that was how things worked. With the money that they pay Roger Buck. <laughs> <laughs> oh, nice. Come on. Oh! God, Kicks. just overwhelming How is his head him. still on there? Oh, ah. double clothesline. Same yeah, idea, yeah. same result. As I make the tag. Back he does Malik. Double slingshot. Oh, that's got to do it. Curbs, that's got to do it. We got new champs. No question. Got a one and two. Wait a oh, minute. Yeah. Oh, wow. The hand is under oh. the rope that initially called for a rope play. I think his foot was also on top of the rope. How Double close trouble was there. that? Huh? Oh, an elbow that sends down the Prince. Double suplex attempt here by the Prodigal Sons. Oh, wait a minute. There's Devo. Devo making the save. Whoa! Got him! Cutter! Big lace cutter! And a super kick. The champs are feeling it. Burn it up! Oh, oh God! Royal Supper! Gonna take his head off! It's over! Wow! During the champion as your first defense, I think that was a great defense for Alex Finley and Devo Knight. Royal flavor. Tremendous matchup. I tell you what, Prodigal Sons have nothing to be ashamed of. They gave it 150%, and damn near on a couple of occasions, walked away with the championship.